Hey guys, so I finally had time um, last night and this morning to finish up um, the stick I was working on, that Cobra that I've been talking about. Um, I got a nice shipment in from Jim Alax from some of the colors that I didn't have, and I think I'm going to do a little video about um, the shooters from Jim Alax and the different, for some reason, the different colors you get, the thicker they are and the more the more uh, supple they are and kind of how, how I use them for each different thing. But um, besides that, um, I'm now affiliated with um, Weston uh, from Colorado, and um, so kind of my first stick that I wanted to string being um, under that title, I kind of wanted to do an homage to him and kind of show him, pay, pay him respects for having faith in me and also um, for what he's done for the, uh, the lacrosse stringing community. And um, just a really, really awesome guy and really have a lot of respect for him. So um, I decided to take my favorite pocket that he's designed um, and kind of put my spin on it, make it something more like um, in the realm of what I string. And so I took his Cobra Light pocket and tweaked it a little bit. I added a double thick coil at the top with double interlocks going all the way down. And then also um, the center track's a little bit different. I actually did um, double overknots on the same side so it creates these little, as you can see, diamonds in the center, kind of like on, like on a diamondback snake I was thinking of because the cobra. So it was just a cool little variation of it. And then I brought a full saddle all the way down with the double interlocks. And then um, I also added um, heat outers to it. So the center tracks in the forest green, the, the white pita twists, or double interlock twists are um, in white and then the heat outers are in gray with the two white leathers and the black, uh, the two white leathers in the center and the black leathers on the outside with the black nylon top and then my straight and my two curved shooters as I do always. This sticks also for the same guy that I did the, uh, the uh, MX, Brian MX4 with the pita in it with the same colors. So he wanted that, but um, a little bit of variation because it's a white head. Um, so yeah, so check it out. Really, really love the way it turned out. And um, with the features I added, I think it adds a little bit more hold to the stick or, or just for my preference of hold, I would say. Um, it's a really nice, Really nice. I've never done a pocket with having this many leathers in the center of it, so um, I wasn't too sure how the throw would be and how it would feel and how tight everything needed to be. But um, it, I think it really came out great. Um, the uh, the heat outers I think really give it some stability, and um, but yet let the pocket move. And you can see a great great shot right there of the of the mid to high pocket. It's a little bit lower than some of mine because it's it's not for me. But um, he he did want a defined pocket like I have, but I didn't want to give him too much width and so um, I think this mixed with that center track really gives the stick a great smooth release yet giving it a lot of hold. So um, I also might do a video on me throwing with it and um, the hold you get from it if you guys are interested in that. Um, but yeah, so here you can see the heat, uh, the heat looped outers, the dubber and the locks and then um, the saddle that comes all the way down with the center twist. So then in terms of hold on the thing feels nice. It's a little bit stiffer than um, PETA in terms of you don't really feel the ball um, gripping as much, but the um, the release is just so smooth. Look at that. Smooth. Nice and easy. And then in terms of hold, it's pretty nice. Right about there. So not as much as the heat, but I think when it breaks in, it'll get a little bit more. And the, um, the overall feel of the it's nice. You can really feel the ball stay in the place. So, so I just want to share that with you and um, thanks again to Weston for inventing the pocket and letting me string one and um, also for um, his affiliate program. I'm really excited to string some stuff for you guys and get some more of my stringing and my sticks out there. And um, So comment if you have any questions let me know. Um, and uh, also su subscribe um, if you guys are interested in seeing me throw with it and um, let me know and I'll try and pop a video out today I have lacrosse a little bit later but it's, it's getting kind of um, dark outside so if I don't go I'll probably just throw around in the apartment again and, and make a video of this stick even though I'm supposed to deliver it today it's going to be hard to let this one go so yet again this is the, my version of the Cobra Light on a, on a, or, yeah my version of the Cobra Light on a Warrior Cobra and um, yeah, thank you guys. Have a good one.